Well, parts of the Delaware Valley, including Philadelphia itself, are under an excessive heat warning. This dangerous heat impacts our moods and mental health. It can anyway. Yeah, health reporter Stephanie Saul joining us now with more on heat anxiety. Mm -hmm. That's right. It is happening to some people, that's for sure. You know, the biggest health risk related to this heat wave is heat stroke. Doctors say this scorching weather can also make some people a little extra cranky. Whether you're working or taking a break, there's one word to describe being outside under a next weather alert. It's terrible. It's terrible. If you don't stay hydrated or protect yourself from being overheated, doctors say the prolonged heat wave gripping the Philadelphia region is dangerous physically and mentally. Studies indicate that excessive heat triggers feelings of anxiety, agitation, irritation, and cognitive difficulties. Psychologists say those kinds of heat reactions can range from mild to severe. In fact, during heat waves, we see an increase of suicides, substance use, domestic violence, and emergency room visits due to mental health issues. Doctors say in extreme temperatures, our bodies have to work harder to keep us cool, and that can cause the release of stress hormone cortisol. The heat doesn't cause mental health issues, but it does exacerbate many of the symptoms that people experience. And the heat can also disrupt sleep, which can make people more irritable and also make it harder to focus and function in general. Take a cold shower or put a cold washcloth on your forehead. This is going to instantly help with the cognitive symptoms that you may be experiencing during heat waves, such as focus and attention. In addition to drinking plenty of water, eating foods with a high water content can also be helpful. Some examples include cantaloupe, strawberries, watermelon, and grapes. And doctors say people at high risk can be especially hard hit mentally by this heat. That's why we are all reminded it's very important to check on the elderly who live alone because this heat wave, as it goes on and gets more prolonged, yeah. it becomes more dangerous to yeah. people. Absolutely. For the most vulnerable. Thank you, Steph. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Steph.